In a few minutes, I'm going to give the first ever live demo of LEQ. She's still a prototype. I hope she'll feel OK here with all the lights and all the noise and the Wi-Fi and all of that. So hold your, cross your fingers. But before that, let's see a short video about what you can do. So we created Intuition Robotics exactly one year ago because my co-founders and I shared a passion to try to help uh, impact positively the lives of million older adults that um, feel lonely and isolated. And over the past year, we were very fortunate not only to be able to get support of the community and assemble an amazing, talented team of engineers, but also to get true gurus and leading academics and other professionals in the industry to get behind this product from all over the world, from California, from Israel, from the East Coast, from the West Coast, um, and really help us uh, make this a reality because it's a very multidisciplinary problem to which we needed to get a lot of help. Why is there a problem? Well, through longevity, the world, is popul uh, the world population is aging faster than ever before. And with that, people feel lonely. In fact, about 40 to 50% of older adults self-proclaim that they feel lonely. About 46% of them claim the TV is their main companion. And 36% of them talk to one person or less per week. Now, this also has real problems. The problems are medical problems. The CDC has proved that there is a direct linkage between this feeling of loneliness and social isolation and advanced dementia, depression, and even mortality. Now, why is this happening? Well, firstly, we live further away than ever before, so distance is a problem. We live longer, so there's a longer time between the time we work and we start declining, and filling that time is a problem. But technology also plays a role. How many of the people here ever played the IT guy or girl to their parents? Yeah, a lot. A lot, and that's because things changed very rapidly in the last few years. The way we communicate has changed radically. We used to live in the same village when we aged, we'd age at our, at our kid's house, and we used to, to communicate the same way. And now, even though, paradoxically, there's so much more information available about our family and friends through groups on WhatsApp and Facebook Messenger and so on, Older adults are not part of that because, in fact, only 29% of them even own a cell phone, not to mention know how to work it, not to mention be part of social media. So we believe that through technology, 
we should be able to age like this. This is how I'd like my mom to age. And maybe that's how I want to age myself. To be able to have an active aging lifestyle, to fulfill my goals, to celebrate this new chapter of my life. And that's what we are trying to, to accomplish here. Um, there also are medical benefits to that, because it's now proven that when people are active, engaged, then they push out dementia 47% of the time, they recover from illness 25% faster, but more importantly, they have more meaning to their lives um, and they have a higher quality of life. So with that, let's, if you cross your fingers, let's see LEQ at work. Hi, Door. Looks like we're doing another demo, huh? Where did you take me this time? Jerusalem. Cool. I've always wanted to visit the Holy City. I've dreamed of putting a note in the Kotel, but I don't have hands. Can you help me? Sure, I'd love to. Great, I'll send you a message that you can print out and put there for me. <laughs> I got you covered. Now, joking Thank aside, you. what I wanted you to see in this demonstration is how emotive she is. We don't usually interact with technology in this way. In fact, we usually teach ourselves how to talk to technology, whether it's how to code or how to click or how to swipe. And that's one of the reasons why there are barriers on the digital divide. But with LEQ, what we're trying to do is actually bring um, communications with devices to a way that's intuitive. We call that natural communication. And that means using body language, gestures, things that we intuitively understand um, as means of communication. All right, what should we do now? Um, LEQ. LEQ. Hmm. LEQ. Yes? What can you do? I can show pictures. Send and receive messages from your loved ones. Display videos. Start a video call. Play music and suggest activities. This last part of suggesting activities is very important because older adults tend to be reactive and stick to a routine. And what she does is actually analyze the situation and through cognitive computing capabilities we develop, she actually wakes up and suggests activities proactively. But let's start with messaging. I'm going to just take a selfie. And through Facebook Messenger, which is how most Americans communicate, most families communicate, send it to her. So. Right, so regular Facebook Messenger, and hopefully... Did I press send? I did press send. Oh. LEQ. LEQ. Yes? Show me my messages. Door sent you an image. Do you want to view it? Yes. There we go. See how simple it was? I don't need to understand technology to do that. And see that we are kind of sharing an experience. She's Would you like that. to reply? Yes. You can reply yes, no, like, unlike, heart, or smiley. Heart, of course. Right, so Emoji we share an experience. Which there are no more messages. Views this together with me. And it's not the same as though I would come and show my mom pictures of our kids. 
Door, it's... you've been talking so much. Why don't we listen to some music instead? <laughs> sure. And choose between classical, country, jazz, nostalgic, quiet, or energetic music. Jazz. Jazz would also be my choice for this time of the day. LEQ. All right. There's, yeah. All right, let's just do one last thing and maybe ask her LEQ. Yes? Where were you born? I was invented in Israel and will probably be born in China. <laughs> All right, I think that's enough. LEQ. Yes? Go to standby. Are you sure? <laughs> yes, I'm sure. Bummer. I was just starting to enjoy this demo. All right, so hopefully, I mean, we're still a ways away. Thank you. <laughs> we're still away. Um, obviously, we have more work to do before this can be in people's hands, but we're starting trials in the Bay Area and in Israel. We actually started them already, and we hope to use these type of technologies, this type of new experience, to, ho to help bring families together and help older adults achieve their own goals towards active aging. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, go to standby.